if you're on version 2021 or above, for GTA materials to work. Set to Max Legacy and restart 3DS Max. In this video you will learn how to create a custom neon gradient using only Vertex Alpha. It is also possible to create a custom gradient texture, which may be ideal as the PC version of the game has poorly compressed neon textures. In front of us, we have the original Neon from the PC version. I will start by creating a square plane of 2x2 two two meters. In order to accurately see the Neon in Viewport, we'll need to set up a shader. The color of the Neon is also found in this shader, which we can add to Vertex Color Channel just before exporting. We only need to add three edge loops to the neon. The two edge loops are for the gradient intensity, and the center edge loop is to create the illusion of a physical light. The beauty of creating your own neon with Vertex Alpha is you have the ability to set the strength of the gradient to have multiple neon variations and that it doesn't require UV mapping or textures to work. 